Hey ladies and gents, Rook here and welcome to Normal Films. Today we're going to continue our iMovie tutorials, iMovie 10.1.1 and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys or clear some things up regarding the error that many get when they are importing media from a USB or a camera. It says uh, referencing media from camera and thus not allowing you to export or upload your video. So let's go ahead and open up iMovie and the best way to show you guys this is by demonstrating it. But I'm going to go ahead and import media straight into my tutorial project that I have here. And uh, I'm going to plug in my external USB that I have here and it will pop up here in the devices. Oftentimes this is done within a camera though um, because the camera is what will actually cause the issue. But when you go ahead and import media from a camera to your computer, and it is not recommended you import it straight into iMovie. It is first recommended you move that footage or images <clears throat> into a folder. For example, I have this tutorial here and uh, it's 4.5. I'm going to go ahead and hit import selected. It's going to import directly from my USB and put it straight into the actual project. Now, uh, completely removing my external as USB or in this case, it would be your camera. <clears throat> now, what is happening is your footage, <clears throat> your original footage is actually still on your camera. That is if only you have not dragged it somewhere within a folder on your actual uh, computer. So uh, what I'm saying here is <clears throat> basically if you are importing media, <clears throat> photos, images, <clears throat> any of that sort that can be used with an iMovie, it is recommended first to uh, when you plug in your camera, go ahead and import it into, for example, just make a new folder, right click on your desktop and name it, uh, for example, you can name it anything you want, but like media, <clears throat> media. and then uh, then plug in your camera and whenever it is recognized through your computer, go ahead and open it up and then save that footage within that folder. That way it is actually on your computer and then from this, from this point, you can actually, when you go to import, you can go to your desktop, you can go to that media folder and then you can hit and then import selected and it'll import that footage from that actual folder. And uh, as you can see, it didn't duplicate it here. It just kept the same one. Now it is referencing that media from my actual desktop from the media folder because it's actually on my computer. And uh, from this point on, I can actually go ahead and uh, once I've created my project, I can go ahead and make that put in the footage that I want in my project and I can successfully export without any issues or any kind of errors besides that actually it wants to duplicate it and uh, I don't want it to add a theater so I'm going to uncheck that and there you have it just like that and it's already actually exporting right here at the top right showing me that it's exporting. And that's basically it for this video, you guys. Be sure to leave any questions and comments in the comment section below. I'll be more than happy to help you guys. Thank you guys, and later. So let my life be